if you love playing games, if you love playing card games, board games, you know, sitting around playing video games with friends, um, it's an opportunity to kind of dive deeper into it if you have that interest, you know, d regardless of your major or your program. If, you know, you find yourself on a Saturday night hanging out with friends, playing board games and thinking, oh, we could totally make our own. Um, this just takes that to the next level and gives you the opportunity to do it for school credit, which is kind of cool. Game designing as such is, a, is such a broad topic, to be honest, because you have 3D artists. You have 2D artists before that who actually, you know, make our 2D concept arts, um, after which the 3D artists are going to take that and develop them into characters or environments or props or anything like that. All the students who were, are going to take up this course are going to be able to work in multiple industries, which means that let it be gaming, let it be uh, film, photography, anywhere. Like, you name it, and then they, they can definitely work over there. We're open to people all across the, again, like whatever their interest is in the industry. Um, but there is a heavy focus on art, on design, uh, being in art and design. If you like to draw, if you like to, you know, produce graphics on the computer, like you're gonna get to do that in this class uh, and produce, you know, your own full-fledged board game. Everyone's required to experience 2D, 3D, game engines and development and board game design. You can come in with zero coding knowledge and we'll take you all the way to, to being able to produce, you know, any mechanic you can imagine. Students from any kind of major, whether it be from the computer science um, department or the art department or from the, you know, business majors, um, whoever they are, they can always take up our courses because we're trying to develop a course where you start from the basics. You take simple steps slowly so that you can develop a whole game, but you will definitely be able to develop a full game by the end of the whole certification course.